Hey, folks, Quilly King here, and welcome to an episode of a Let's Play Stellaris. We are the Space Kitties, and we're in this ginormous war against the stupid Federation, but it is nearly over. Uh, and I'll probably start a war with the Purifiers after this, because it's, it's a very good CB. We can take a lot of land very easily, and it should be kind of excellent. Plus, these guys are big jerk faces, so we'll see what we can do to deal with them. These guys are just the, um, yeah, the, the Marauder types, so maybe we'll do something over there as well. One of the things I did is I went through these star bases over here and made sure that, uh, no, we don't need to upgrade you, but I want a shipyard over here. Um, a bunch of these are gonna have little shipyards and I'm doing the same thing over here. Um, replacing, for example, some of these trading hubs, which I don't need as much, although you can see my income has been dropping here. Uh, I guess because I'm not running the energy focus thing, but that's okay. We'll get some extra shipyards here. Irani is going to get upgraded to a proper starport because I do have the limit just so I can build a few more ships on the front here. Hekka was my starbase for that, but we did lose it. Um, and right now, this Titan class isn't necessarily in the position to go and hit some of these things. So I'm going to park it kind of near here. Actually, I'm wondering if I should pull back uh, a little bit in, in case I get jumped on and lose the Titan. It does have some ships coming its way, though. So I don't know. It'll probably be okay. We will see. Um, and then, yeah, the rest of my fleet just chilling out. Here, they're doing some bombards, and we do have a transport fleet on the way. You are getting some upgrades. I mean, everyone's pretty busy, so I think we'll be okay there. We're gonna lose that science ship. Oh, no, it warped away good, so we don't lose the scientists. Not that it matters that much. And you're coming over here to re those guys. Well, I'm wondering. Hmm, yeah, that would be a little tight. We don't have to go rushing after these guys. If they attack me, it's probably not so bad. We'll see. So we still have a lot of minerals in the bank, and we could certainly be building more things simultaneously. Oh, you're just getting repaired right now. We might want to merge you with one of the other fleets and take some hits that way. These guys are happy to take a uh, status quo as is, and it'll probably only become more so soon. Uh, tell you what. I'm going to jump you to here. Building ruined. I'm going to get you to just wait here. We'll merge you up together, and that's going to be fine. So, that ground invasion. Grrr. Very annoying. Yeah, pairing up in the shipyards will also... Oh, that's the other thing I did in Apon over here. I was like, you know what? These static defenses, maybe we don't need as much. I'm going to build some extra shipyards, because it's a good staging ground, and this way we can upgrade three fleets simultaneously, or just build a lot more ships a lot faster over here. Are you... Hello. Is this a thing that we're doing? Okay. Oh, my Titan's in there, too. I guess my fleet with the kids. Boom. Done. So, the kitten fleet. Which, actually, these are more kittens, right? Yeah, I'm going to remove you. There we go. Excellent. And then drop you, group you guys together. So this big fleet, bigger, slower fleet. You're just going to come by here and babysit Sirius, which we have a claim on and we want to take. Plus one core system is fine. Unity Ambitions said, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, and an Ascension perk. Yes, we definitely want that. Both the Ascension perk and to be able to spend our Unity points on Ambitions because we don't really care about the diplomacy thing. In fact, you know, in hindsight, maybe I should have just saved it all. I couldn't remember how it unlocked. So you're just chilling here for now, which I think is important. How big of a fleet is this? 12,000. We'll get there. We'll get there. It's going to be fine. Maybe I'll actually hang out here. Well, actually, I'm... You know what? We'll pull back here. Wherever we go... So now we're nice and safe, but we can still jump on anything. There we go. We'll do this. Ripper auto cannons. Uh, advanced ant auto burners is fun. I don't think we need to go up the railgun track. I don't know. Flak out artillery. We're still using both these. We don't need this armor because we have the class six armor. Um, armor torpedoes, I think, would be better for my my little kittens if we keep going that way. I think I don't remember what the the train of torpedo upgrades are, but we may as well get it. It's a quick little upgrade, so why not? You're just hanging out over here. Oh yeah, these are my kittens, which have merged together, um, and do have some upgrades pending. I guess it's, yeah, they got the next level of rippers. 
And that's the upgrade coming in for them, which is kind of nice. Yeah, we might want to wait until we get the next level torpedoes, which I think is what's being uh, researched there. Can you just go and kill this transport fleet? That would be nice. You guys move fast. Should be able to unload a lot of damage very quickly. That'll be nice. So you're coming back over here. Where we have the planet, but nothing else. Uh, so as you should rename some of these. I, I've lost my yarn chasers. Tell you what. Actually, really, the chasers should almost become the kittens. The kitten army should be the, the chaser ones, in a sense, but that's all right. Oh, and you don't have an admiral. And we've got plenty of admirals, so let's go ahead and get you in here. Transport fleet can jump at this point and go there. Uh, I am going to get a claim on this, but we really need the contiguous thing. We're going to leave maybe this system behind. It's kind of funny. I love creating border gore for my my enemies. It pleases me greatly. Science ship here with no scientist and no spare scientist, unfortunately, unless we retire someone else. Omega Theory. The Omega Alignment Building. So we'll see about getting that done. Resource Replicator, faster attacks. Um... Just more hit points. I mean, these are repeatable, so... No, I, I'm gonna go through and get some of the non-repeatable text done. We're gonna take another planet over here. And, um... I mean, we do need some energy. What this thing is... Where can I build this? Oh, it has to be on the capital. Okay. Oh, I think that'll probably, like, pull the, uh, the big beastie in. And I don't remember. What is it? It produces physics. Do we have, like, base physics tile? Base physics tile over here, just to maintain that. Omega alignment. I think this is the thing... I don't know if this is the thing that triggers it immediately, but, like, turns your our species, or at least some of our species, into the I love two worlds, and turns everything here into two worlds. Something like that. Um, I'm assuming you can just go ahead and land your army. This has been bombarded forever. Yeah, there's literally no one defending, so that's going to be okay. I might keep this fleet here just to make sure it doesn't get retaken, just in preparation for the peace deal. Right, you're doing that. Zarn chasers are chilling over here and waiting for some reinforcements to come in. That's still being built. Any presence and that got built. manually queue up a battleship to join up over here. That's going to be fine. And yeah, we're going to want to jump on Hekka. Invasion commenced. We'll need our transport fleet back here for that. Construction complete. Building route. Oh, you're done. Oh, right, because it was an instant. There was no one defending. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, so, jump to here. And it's going to take you a long time to come. We'll have to queue up a few more. Upgraded. Not queue up a few more jumps, but get a few more jumps in there. Yeah, you're just chill. Can you repair here? Do you have a shipyard? You do, so you can just upgrade in place. Excellent. And you're waiting there. You're guarding Sirius, which I'm okay with. This fleet here, though, can say jump and then make its way down here in case we need some more muscle to clear some stuff out. Construction complete. Ah! The worm loves us and perhaps we could love the worm. Ends the chain, begins a new chain, generate entry point, special project. Let's do it. Boom. Vessels upgraded. It's fine, what could possibly go wrong? Construction complete. <laughs> Oh, I love the event. It's so great. I can't believe we just, like, randomly got that Special to go for us. Complete. Yes, whatever it requires. We consent. The future. What was shall be, what shall be was. So, Tomb World. But we've got more Tomb Worlds that we can settle in our home system, which is stupendous. If we take a look at our species... Yeah. So, like, Kendra Pline. It's just, it's just a tomb world. <laughs> um, and yeah, let's take a look at our species. 
This is the one with Tomb World Habitability. Repugnant. Uh, we also get Natural Physicists. So what we want to do is we want to convert all our people to this version of the Gilbertons. Boom. Because then we get the extra physics thing going on. There you go. Just two years to research. That's not bad at all. <clears throat> I did do that the right way, right? Uh, we'll to have the following traits. Tomb World Preference. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Which, in addition to, like, being okay on Tomb Worlds, just makes you, like, good with everything. Now, uh, for Expansion Planner, if we... I don't know. We can, yeah, we can really just go anywhere. Uh, what's the... There it is, like that. And we gotta make sure to use the Tomb World people. So we'll just we'll just keep doing it from from Gilbert. Uh, you know what? Let's use the minerals. Or the sorry, the energy. They're not huge planets, and of course, more systems we colonize, more planets we colonize, we do get some extra cost. But what the hell, right? We can, therefore, we will. Size 23 Tomb World. Could have started with that one, I guess. This is fine. Uh, we got the tropical world over here. Let's hold off on that. Until we figure out where the heck all this stuff is. Do, 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 do. So you're yeah, even just waiting around over there, which I'm kind of okay with because I want to be able to... Uh, remind me, do I actually have claims on Sirius? Yes, I do. Good. So we want that to continue. I mean, we could go after more of these groups, but we'll leave it there. You're up to 10k. We've got this fleet. You know what? If we tell you we want to take point here now. I think we can get started on this. Incoming raid. Okay. That's fine. We can handle it. Uh, we're going to go ahead and get you guys to upgrade. Not doing anything else right now. That's going to be fine. Yarn Chasers are just going to finish that off, and that's okay. So yeah, we're going to retake this land here. And yeah, our ally might lose a little bit of territory here. Tough. I don't care about them. Uh, that's that extra battleship. I'm going to get you to jump here, and then I'll tell you to join the Yarn Chasers. Move over here. So yeah, Yarn Chasers and that. There you go. Take you a while to, to catch up to them, but you can do it. I have faith in you. Martial Law Edicts, you're fine there. Speaking of Edicts, though, uh, are we okay? Yeah, everything's fine. Got lots of minerals again. Yeah, we'll be doing some big, like, fleet queue-ups. Well, we're actually at our naval capacity right now, so... Not that it would hurt us too much from going over. More Martial Laws are going away, but I think it's fine. We do have some hostile fleets here, but I don't think they're all that dangerous. Uh, 10,000? Hold on. Stop. They might come at me. Let me pull back over here. Make it a little easier for this one to merge in. Sure, we'll go over a limit. I mean, you know, why not, right? Don't you have a shipyard? Oh, right. We built this, but we didn't actually build a shipyard. Um, so do that and build me a trading hub again, actually. It's going to be fine. Because we can use some money. So we'll balance it a little bit. Here, you got some extra people coming in here. So we'll group up here and then we'll probably do a jump on one of these guys. You're holding serious. Part of me does want to go and beat them up over there. So these are all my Corvettes. Like this is an 18k fleet of just pure Corvettes. I like it. Well, you move so fast, we might be able to get you to just help down here. You know, actually, that's probably the right thing to do. You're going to jump to here, and then you're going to make your way somewhere down to the front. We'll figure out what to do with you when you get here. Receiving communications. Research agreements. Again, you know, they're getting a much better research agreement than I am, and I don't really need the energy, but that's okay. We'll say yes anyway. Okay, direct fleet air enemies. That's okay. Holding on to Yurgle for now. They're at 100%. 
I mean, that we can't just say achieve war goals, but yeah, we're, we're gonna have to go and, and retake this. Oh, uh, transport fleet, are you ready for another jump? You are, so we're gonna go ahead and do that and then tell you to keep moving. Because clearly we're gonna need some people to retake Hera, and then that'll be the end of the war. Meanwhile, tech's going fine. Zero G mining platform disrupted. Hmm, mining platform. But I like my man mining platforms. They give me minerals to do things with. I do have enough to make some more claims. I don't, I don't know. We could consider grabbing a bunch more territory over here, perhaps. Let's hold off until it's just in time for the peace deal. We might need to do a bunch of uh, martial law stuff as well, which does cost some points. Still waiting on the shipyard. Uh, you've got, um, you're building two at a time, which is very nice. Get a couple more battleships. Science ship running away. Savage hordes touching down. Failed to fend off invasion in Hecka Prime. Oh, I didn't realize they hadn't quite invaded yet. These, I think, are just the Marauders. That's why they're just being dumb. Uh, no, just Untaunt. Okay, maybe they just made a mistake here. Cool. Rebuild a couple of defense platforms. Actually, if anyone should be a Citadel, it should be you. Do that. So we're over, over our fleet limit now, but that's okay. A couple of battleships here. Can jump to there. We'll get you to move here too. We can still jump basically anywhere. Zero G research output violently diminished. Oh, I think more of our place are being blown up. You know what? Fine. Take it. We'll take the thousand minerals. I mean, we might be able to negotiate something else, but that sounds like work. I don't care for work. Let's go to fastest temporarily. So all you guys are merging together. I mean, I think you were already doing that, but... Uh, there's our kittens. Yeah, they do move fast, huh? Okay. I'm just gonna get you to jump here. Colonization in progress. Hooray, colonization. And you guys are merging up. And then once you do, wow, you made a terrible mistake moving into this system. Uh, anytime now, come on, merge up, because I'm gonna get you to jump. Go. Man, these big ships move slow. I suppose I could move the other one to meet up, but that's all right. Seriously, though. Thank you. God, that took a while. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to get you to jump over here. 25k fleet. It's going to be okay. You're going to make this move. This move. And then I don't think I can shift click over here, actually, because of the FDL. Raiders. Raiders hit here. Oh, they're raiding this end of things. Oh. Well, that's kind of annoying. I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to grab one of my fleets and send them away through here. Because we're going to want them over here to do the purifier soon. Oh, no more bashing? Then? Okay. Well, then halt. I guess that's all you were doing. And you... Oh, that's another pair of battleships. We're not going to queue up anymore, I don't think. You can come over to here is what you're going to do. Boom, boom. Clean that out. Okay. Technology secured. Done. What technology? What do I get? Armored torpedoes. Nice. I think that's going to be good for our kittens. Mega cannon is what we want. We want this. Actually, we want to go into a giga cannon. That's really what we want, I believe, for our, um, our uh, battleships. Because the, the Mega slash Giga Cannons can strip away shields really quickly, and then the Neutron Torpedoes will do crazy stuff. Presumably you've actually retaken the system and you just haven't locked it in yet. Uh, that's a lot of fleet edge, although we're going to double team them very shortly. Communications. Oh, you're going over there. Hold on, then. Oh, I can't jump. Oh, they're splitting up, oddly. Okay. Uh, they're looking for peace right now, but hang on a sec. i got to retake Hekka. How's my transport fleet coming along? Oh, they've got another jump ready to go. Jump. Move to Hekka. This 
So let's take a look and see. Oh, we're not quite as strong as we would like, are we? This actually could work out badly for my little kittens. At least they took that out of the picture very early. We've got great evasion. So yeah, their chance to hit is really low. And yeah, we went from 11k to 16k for some reason. I don't know. Look at that. 45% chance to hit. They're doing very little damage to us. I, I love these little kittens. I'll definitely be focusing on this sort of build, I think. Well, I don't know. I still like my big battleships, too. They could still lose this. There's a lot of ways that something like that could happen. But not too shabby. All right. Uh, laser chasers. Right. You're just defending over there, which is fine. You're just defending over here, which I'm also fine with. Um, oh, we don't actually have this system. Someone else retaken that. I'd missed that. That would have been kind of annoying for the peace deal. You're doing this. You are still trying to come over here slowly. Uh, speaking of things going slowly, you're going to come over here and jump. It didn't take us that long to cross the system as I thought. You finish this. I might be able to have my little fleet chase these guys. Although, what's the point? Let's do some of this. We might, we might have claims and or want to make claims in the systems here. Giving us a bigger buffer between Hekka and the border might actually work out really nicely for us. Okay, how did this not flip? To our control. I'm really confused. Species modified. Wow, that was fast. All right. We're all super Gilbertons now. Two more old, all that kind of jazz. You are going to come here. They've got some occupation, but not much. All right. Are you actually in... I'm very confused as to what's happening here. Are you actually in combat with the outpost? You are. What the shit, man? Okay, you're going to engage it. Good. Colonization in progress. Yay, colonization. I might want to make some sort of big sector or something. All right, good. Now, you are going here. Yes, excellent. Surface. No, you're fine. Oh, yeah, yeah. These are all... None of these planets have been established yet. Martial law has expired over here. Okay. You're just chilling over there. Your job. Actually, jump to here. Meanwhile. Another win. Come here. Go there. We've got upgrades waiting on the kittens as well. I love the kitten fleets. I think that's going to be great. Now, take back Hekka. Uh, we need to take Binder as well. Probably these kittens can jump over to Binder. Yeah, just jump to Binder. I think the jump is down on this ship. Yeah, so you'll go and take this. Hekka will be retaken, and then we wipe peace out. Almost certainly. We'll go and double check a few things. We've got this. We don't have a claim on this system. I don't know if it's worth it. Uh, taking this system might actually be worthwhile, though. I'd say so. It's adjacent, so it's a little cheaper. Although I suppose we could take this so that in the future we can grab the wormhole. Or maybe we even want to grab the wormhole this time. I don't know where it goes. We'll have to explore it. Yeah, take this, and then we'll get you to jump over here and take that system. Yeah, that'll work out well. And next time these boneheads start a war, we're going after Seoul. Okay. System's ours. Clear out the transports. Jump to here. It's going to be our wormhole. And then I think we peace. Presumably. Um, did you not actually land your army? We'd like to extend our deal. Yes, please. We have... Well, we're currently losing energy, although that's probably because we're over our limit. Once this peace happens, I think we'll be in much better shape. Commenced. And you, how powerful is this? Oh, no, we've got that. Do we, though? 
ground invasion force has seized a planet. Well, now we're gonna, because what I'm gonna do is jump my big fleet to here. I think our ally has a claim on that. But that's fine. Kill some more dudes. White piece. So, it's been a long war. The important thing is not to let these guys kill us, which is true, and every every time we can, nibble a bit more. It's costly, although it costs them just as much. And what else are we doing with our minerals, other than building a giant death fleet? I mean, really. Uh, you stay here a little bit longer. Although, I think there's a, there's a shipyard in that system, so you can upgrade where you are. There you go. That's going to be swell. Done, done, done. Okay. As far as I know, we're in good shape. They will take some planets from my ally. Tough to be him. Accept this for now. Okay. Too many colonized systems. Some of it's over here. Uh, I don't know if I want a new sector just because my governor status is being hammered pretty hard. I think Hekka fell out of a system over here. What is my what is my system over here called? Or sector. I keep saying system. Okay, it is this one. So, we'll add heck in there. Did I just take it out? Son of a bitch. I just wanted it to be contiguous. Because it was being kind of weird. Although I think it was actually fine. Um, we took some land over here. I think this whole thing may just become a new sector because there's literally nothing there. We don't have enough governors, and I don't necessarily like that, but it'll be the a pond. I'm going to add a bunch of this stuff in here. And that... There we go. Brings us well below the core limit. And that's going to be okay. Um, you can go and get some credits. Same thing there. And let me kickstart your building with a little bit of that, like that. Okay. Meanwhile, we did land on a planet over here. Or this is one we took. How are you doing? Oh, you have no unrest. I guess just do your thing. Clear that. Um, repair. I wonder if we get prompted for buildings needing repair. Because there's not really a visible symbol. Okay, there we go. Maybe, and you don't actually have something here, but we don't, we still don't need more food. Oh, um, I'm going to demolish you. And replace you with, oh, a loop institute. Happiness. Science of a type we don't actually care about as much. Whatever. Lupin streets are cool. Plus the happiness boost is going to be handy. Uh, we've got inactive buildings over here. Yeah, that, that's going to be okay. All right. All of my war fleet now. I think I'm going to literally take every single ship and tell them, do your best to get to... Where's my territory over here? Here. Um, there's a wormhole here and a wormhole here. In terms of attack, I think what I'd like to do is just deal with this little curly cue here. Get rid of it. Got a gateway. I don't know. Let's meet up. Um, yeah, let's meet up in Bintu to start off with. They're all going to take the same wormhole jump. That's interesting. But yeah, meet up there. Uh, you have to what? Just in case we need to do more upgrades, you're going to get a second shipyard, and I'll upgrade you as well. We might end up with like four shipyards there for very rapid upgrades of some kind. Construction complete. Okay. Unpaused for a second, then it went away. Ideology casts his belly against us. People keep trying to do that. I love this. Just a little, little troll spot. It's excellent. So you're moving. That's good. We are... We actually not over a fleet limit. Look at that, how much naval capacity we got. We're way over our starbase capacity, which is probably why we're losing a bajillion dollars. However, what we can do is... We can't. Okay, never mind. I'm gonna capacity overload. We've got enough money in the bank. We can withstand this for a little bit. Um, I could disband some of these stations. Like you over here, for example. I oh, yeah, unexplored. So. My poor science ship. 
I'm gonna park you here. Oh, can I explore you without a scientist? What? I didn't know that. That's cool. Colonization in progress. Oh yeah, that's another place where money's going right now. And we'll probably build some more energy things on these planets. It might be like, yeah. It's funny how this keeps going back and forth, but it's the it's the excess star bases. I could get rid of some of these. Uh, this one's around a planet. You're around a wormhole. Planet. Planet, planet. Mm, no, I kind of like those. Um, Laser chasers. Well, you're all moving right now, so we'll wait to do upgrades after that. And then we'll probably... What we're also going to do is reorganize our fleets. We, we won't need more ships to fight the purifiers. We'll reorganize it. Keep the, like, dedicated kitten fleets. I love it. Move fast. Do a fair amount of damage. Losing a few... Uh, you know, Corvettes here and there doesn't really matter terribly much. Some of these might be able to get merged together. I mean, the thing is, I'm not expecting much of an opposition here. Yeah, pathetic compared to ours. We should be able to rip through this with multiple separate fleets much more effectively than anything else. Might almost want a second transport or something like that. Or a few more, although they're pretty expensive too. Wormhole has been explored. Okay. Oh, is this it? Interesting. What does that mean for us? The regime. Are they part of the Just Entente? Yeah, they are. So, they're enemies and jerk faces. So this place here is going to become a citadel. Well, that's why you have so much goddamn uh, limit. Um, I think these are all going to get replaced with gun batteries. I'll keep the shipyard here. Get some more defense platforms. Because, yeah, that's definitely an avenue people could come in. So, that's going to be fine. Oh, you over here. You're the one complaining about not having a building. Power plant you. Okay. Bunch of planets still coming. Got the peace deal over there. So sorry to my ally. We'll get the territory back, buddy. So one way or another. Hey, you got this system. You must be happy about that. That's so meaningful. <clears throat> or something. I can build another Titan? All right. Three Titan class ships. Right, it's one for every 300, right? Uh, no. Because it's based on naval capacity. You just get one plus another one for every 200? It might be something like that. Oh, I gotta put a cut in here. But yeah, I'm excited to be going back to war with these purifiers because we can just like, just blob all this stuff. We would have been able to get them all in one sweep last time if we hadn't been interrupted by the other war. I think, I, I don't know if we like defeated the AI uprising. I don't know what else is gonna happen then. Oh, I think there's still some, uh, yeah, we need to get some little critters over there, which will take forever. Basically be impossible. At this point, the reward's not m worth much, but still. Uh, Mega Cam, we really don't need the Particle Lance, but we'll finish it anyway. It's going to be fine. Yeah, but the battleships are going to do the, the Mega Cannon thing, and I think that's going to be really wonderful. Uh, you guys, oh, you're here, and you're ready to... You'd be going back for some upgrades? No, no, you can upgrade from here, surely. Got dual shipyards. I mean, I guess it's not your home, but... It should still be okay. Anyway, we'll wrap it up here. Thanks for watching. See you next time.